Good morning, folks. I want to share something very, very important with you. You know, uh, most of us have a tendency to get into a negative pattern and this is not something that we choose to do. It is something that happens automatically over a period of time. For example, you know, we, if when we have certain thoughts and those thoughts create certain kind of emotions, what that does is that uh, neurons that fire together wire together. So now automatically every time you have those kind of thoughts like what will happen today, whether it will work out, I don't know if I am capable of this and all of these thoughts come in, it creates the same kind of emotions. It creates emotions of anxiety or fear or worry and all of these. Now slowly and steadily what happens is without you uh, actually trying to think these thoughts, okay, without you being conscious that you are having these kind of thoughts, these thoughts start coming in automatically. And as soon as the thought starts coming in, the emotion starts getting released automatically and your body starts feeling a certain way automatically. Right Now you get into this auto mode of this particular pattern which happens very often and very regularly. Now one of the worst parts of this is that when you wake up in the morning, your mind starts looking for the familiar feeling of me. You know, and that familiar feeling of me starts with these thoughts which are familiar and with these emotions which are familiar. Now, now this starts becoming a part of your identity. You know, if this is such a deeply ingrained pattern that gets into all of us, how do we break this pattern and how do we create a new pattern that is useful for us? Okay, there is a very powerful method to do that. Apparently, research shows that even if we can experience 10 to 15 minutes of positive emotions like joy, excitement, happiness, gratitude, compassion, it really can break these patterns and create new patterns for us. You know, that becomes a doorway to create new patterns. And that is why the practice of gratitude. Okay, so this is the first challenge that we are starting today. It starts from today. So there are only two things that you need to do. You need to have a notebook. If you don't have a notebook, have a bunch of papers. But I really recommend that you maintain a notebook. And every day, write at least 10 things. You can do 20, you can do more. You know, today I've written about 18 things that I'm grateful for. Write it down. You know, don't just think about it, like write it down. And once you have completed this activity in the group, in the WhatsApp group, write down done and put a hard sign next to it and we'll know that you have completed it for the day so it's a 15 day challenge where every day for 15 days each of us will actually write down all the things that we are grateful for you don't have to think of big things that you're grateful for you can think of very little things that you're grateful for i've already given you some examples of that i'm super excited for this challenge and i'm really looking forward to each one of you joining in the challenge no matter what stage of your journey you are at no matter how much of the course that you have done you have not done jump in join in and watch yourself transform okay so looking forward to more of you joining this challenge and we are starting today even if you do this uh, by the end of the day and let us know that you're joining in that's absolutely fine so all the very best and love you all